So it looks good. Damn. Sink the Spanish ship. That's good news for us. Bleeding bastards! We'll have to deal with this skirmish fast. Forget the galleon and send these interlopers to hell! Let's go boys, we did it. She's sailing for that island. I know the place. A natural stronghold used by a French captain named Ducas. Julian Ducas, the Templar. Name's right. Didn't know he had a title. I know the man. And if he sees my ship, he'll know it from his time in Havana, meaning he may wonder at who's sailing her now. I can't risk that. And I don't want to lose that galleon. Let's think on. Maybe wait till it's dark before hopping aboard. Mission complete, guys. Let's go. So, I'll see you guys in our next episode. <laughs> like you know, we do mission for mission. If you want more, let me know. Oh yeah, see you guys in the next one. Peace. Okay, so we gotta locate. Let's take them out, boys. Come to me. You told me they cannot swim, so they died. <laughs> Let's go, boys. Okay. Okay, like we can see, we just look at Julian, guys. So we were on island. I don't know if this recorded. I think we, I did a mistake, but we came to island. Need to locate um Julian the case. So when I came down, I, I just took out part of the guys and I silenced him and I came in and I told myself, let me get on the crew. This is gonna be a big fire, guys. Brace yourself. Hey! They just killed these on guard. Let's go. I'll be ready for you. you. Remember the gift you gave me. Well, I'll just five. Fist of Peter. 
as bold as a musket ball, and still half as sharp. Oh! I'm sorry about this, mate. But I can't risk you telling your Templar friends about me still kicking around. I pity you, Bukenyi. After all you have seen, after all we showed you of our order, still, you embrace the life of an ignorant and aimless rogue! Ah! What's this? His petty larceny, the extent of your ambition. Have you no mind to comprehend the scope of ours? All the empires on Earth, abolished, a free and open world, without parasites like you! Que l'enfer que tu trouveras soit le fruit de ton insouciance. It's cool, guys. Yes, so now it's our island. Oh, it's the boat ours. Don't say that, bro. Don't say that, bro. Okay, guys, that was the mission. Uh, so let's go on to the next mission. T thanks for tuning in. Let's get it then. I just saw you were logging out, so I thought I'd stop by and give you something. A little welcome gift. We give awards to our top-notch employees for doing quality work. And they're nice to have, since there's no official bonus scheme here. I already have about 11 or so. Oh. Bonjour. Of course. I'll pass it on. Well, looks like Olivier wants to meet with you. It's exciting. Follow me. It's on the top floor, so it's not hard to find. But the rest of this building can be confusing to first-timers, so we had the tools team whip up a great map application. Check your communicator. I added a waypoint to Olivier's office. Should be easy to find. Olivier's a nice guy. He won't bite. If you say so. I don't think I haven't even met him yet. Oh. I just pressed the wrong button. <laughs> Hello? Let's go. Hi. Testing, testing. Is this thing working? <coughs> this is John from IT. We met earlier. I, I was calibrating your animus. I'm sort of the, uh, Scotty of this Abstergo Enterprise, in charge of all the tech stuff. Do you have a minute? Oh, oh, ah, oh, damn it. The tracker says you're on your way to Olivier's office. Ah, all right. I'll ping you when you're done. I have a favor to ask. Okay, so we got a favor for him to do. Let's go... Give it... Oh! <laughs> How convenient. I'm Go right in. He's waiting for you. Bonjour. <laughs> Let's see. Well, well, unless you are specifically ordering me to abandon it, I won't uh, jeopardize our flagship project. Edward Kenway is the. But this no. is. But this is how Hollywood got its start, right? With pirate movies. Douglas Fairbanks, Errol Flynn, and now we have access to the real deal. Wait, wait. Exactly. We'll talk about all that together at the shareholders' event. Right. Looking forward to seeing you too. Take care, let's see ya. Oh, I thought he was talking to me the whole time. <laughs> Salut. Okay. Hi, thanks for coming in. I know you're busy. So, I reviewed some of your data. Pretty raw stuff. Obviously, we need to scrub off some of the dirt to make it family friendly. Maybe give Edward a voice like uh, James Bond 
or something. More of a ladies' God, man. Man. It looks beautiful, beautiful city, though. no? <laughs> beautiful though. So the main reason I asked you here concerns is something called the observatory. It's uh, been mentioned a few times in the footage you found. I'd like to encourage you to focus on locating this specific set of memories as soon as possible. If it were up to me, on s'en I wouldn't bother. But some big wigs at Abstergo Industries have been hounding me for days. So, follow whatever leads you find and hopefully we can... Oh, incoming call. I have to take this. We'll keep in touch. Bonne journée. Alan, bonjour. Bonjour. Oui, 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 tout va bien. Naturellement. Okay, so he wants me to... Follow information? If I have this right? Well, let's see this. Cool. Then. Hi, John from IT again. You got a second? This is Good. actually very cool. I'm adding a waypoint to your map. So, uh, a colleague of yours left for vacation this morning and forgot to send a video file she promised me. Since I hate just about everyone else on your floor, I was hoping you could help me. Could you transfer the file from her computer and deliver it to the courier when she comes? It'll be easy. You just wander over to their animus, log in, and transfer the file. Easy. And please be snappy before I find a reason to hate you, too. She wants me to be fair, though. I'm on your doorstep, bro. <laughs> advantage of me having level one security clearance. Now, you do too. Don't abuse it. Log on and I'll walk you through this. Damn, look his stuff though. Actually really good. Cool stuff. Damn. Look like his office though. Wait, oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, up to two minutes. Oh, right. Now, you need to bypass the core to find the data inside. Once you reach it, your communicator will download it automatically. You need to find your way around the core to reach the data inside. That's it? should be downloading. I set up a database for any data you find. Just look for the My File section in your communicator and you'll be redirected right away. Everything you download will be found in there. Uh, protected by a firewall, of course. December 23rd, 2012. Sample Recovery Unit Team Lead Fisher Case reporting on Subject 17, Desmond Miles. The subject was deceased and unattended. Time of death was placed around 0 hundred hours and 7 minutes with conditions favorable for DNA sample recovery. We had some initial concerns about interference in the vault, but given the skill and talent of this team, we were able to capture useful data. I personally retrieved the subject's backpack and extracted a number of objects of interest to undergo detailed analysis. The subject displayed burns to the right hand, severe enough to fuse the bones, indicating some kind of spontaneous, intense burn trauma. Well, Honestly, we've uh, never seen almost all like, like real photos. Head, neck, and torso remained in good condition. I hand-selected recovery agents to retrieve fluid samples, blood and saliva. We then commenced material extraction and were able to preserve several exemplary samples. Data analysis and sequencing is already underway and, I'm told, proceeding with exceptional ease. Thanks to the cloud database and the work of Abstergo Sample Recovery Unit 3, the legacy of Subject 17 will continue uninhibited as Sample 17. We are like a test subject. Sample Recovery Team reported that in collecting the Subject 17 remains for the use of Subject 17. Project. 
December 23rd, 2012. Sample recovery unit team lead Fisher Case reporting on. Oh, subject. it's the same one. Sorry, guys. Oh, you're better at this than I'd hoped. Now zip on down to the lobby. Come on. See that file you acquired? I wouldn't recommend watching it. I mean, ooh, you could, but it's unpleasant. So once you hand it off, just pretend it never happened, okay? Otherwise, you'll just go to bed soon. Sad. Anyway, the courier should be waiting downstairs. She's been here a while. I suppose it goes without saying, just because you now know how to hack all your colleagues' computers, it doesn't mean you should. I mean, not every day, right? <laughs> no, seriously, though, that's illegal, so don't be a dick. Uh, unless that's your nature. I like how they like put like a normal play, and, like you in in this space where you are accessing, and then and you're the lobby because you like this sample you test. It's almost like a game that you're testing. So it's not Oh, look who's here. So you didn't forget, after all, you're just incredibly rude. And they poor Rebecca here wait for nearly 30 minutes. You limey. Be nice. Sorry about him. He's high on his own supply. So, how should we do this? Data transfer? Great. That should do it. We'll email you the receipt. Till next time. Take care, Sean. Bye-bye. Yes, bye. And don't expect any more free coffee. Arrogant. She's great, isn't she? Hey, I just got word the courier has come and gone. Wonderful, you're a miracle. No, 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 that's an exaggeration. You're not a miracle. You're an employee. Doing a job. But thanks for helping out. Anyway, thanks. Have fun. Hire it in. I, don't, I wonder which information that was that we just received. Okay, let's go. Assistance au niveau 2, projet échantillon 17. Support to the second floor, sample 17 project. We got three! Damn. Can we pick it up or something? Not a bad progress. 